Alex here, Transformationist. Today is part three. We're finally on legs, right? Now, as you guys can see, I have a bucket and a coconut. We don't need a coconut. And we, oh, that's heavier than I thought. And we don't need a bucket because we're doing body weight, right? So we're gonna do, again, these are not the most creative or fun exercises, but these are the exercises that I feel are really gonna challenge your body, assuming that you guys are in a general kind of weightlifting type program where we, you know, we see very similar type of exercises. These are gonna create the new training stimulus for you to take advantage, not just to maintain, but to take advantage of your time away from the gym. Okay, let, let me explain a concept to you before I start the leg workout. So, one of the biggest factors, one of the biggest things that creates muscle growth is, is a new training stimulus. When you started working out, you had newbie gains. You didn't build a lot of muscle necessarily because you didn't have any muscle. It's because you were under a new training stimulus. Why were you under a new training stimulus? Because you had never trained before in general, right? If I've been bodybuilding for like 15, I've been bodybuilding competitively for nine years, but working out for 15 years. If I started doing CrossFit for the next month, I can almost guarantee you that I would actually start to build a lot of muscle because I've never done it before, right? So this is why you, a lot of times people swear like, oh, when I was sprinting, I was jacked. When I did CrossFit, I was jacked. When I did yoga, I built a lot of muscle because they were under new training stimulus. All right, so now let's get to the workout. It's six exercises, right? We're doing total number of reps again, and we're gonna do them in this specific order. So first things first, you're gonna do 100 squats, right? All the way down, all the way up. Not too fast, not too slow, nice tempo, nice rhythm, okay? The next exercise is going to be a lunge. You're gonna step back into your lunge, step up. Step back into your lunge, step up, right? Then you're gonna switch legs. So it's 100 on each leg. It's high volume, guys, but this is what's gonna work, okay? The next exercise is gonna be a jumping squat. But how are you gonna perform this jumping squat? You're not going to squat down and jump up high. You're gonna remain low the whole time and go all the way down. So it's gonna be, wide, actually it's sumo, right? Boom, jump up, jump up, jump up, 100. Now is this, <laughs> that's 300 rep volume right there already. We got three more exercises. I know, I know, I know, it's not the most interesting workout, but again, trust me on it, try it. So the next exercise here is gonna be the glute bridge, right? I always swear by glute bridges. Now I'm not getting this white shirt dirty, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this thing off. And I got the mic attached to it right now. You guys like how casual my videos are? Like I'm not trying to be super professional. So you don't have to be poolside, but I am. And we're gonna, oh, this concrete's hot. All right, we're gonna lay here. We're gonna do glute bridges, right? Feet together, not too close, not too far, right? Create the perfect angle, nice and slow. Really focus on contracting the glutes because obviously there's no weight here. So now the next exercise you're gonna do, and that's also for 100. The next exercise you're gonna do here is gonna be a Superman. <laughs> so, <laughs> it's so hot. All right, so the Superman, boom, hands in front of you like this, raise up, raise up, right? Again, 100 reps. So now the first three exercises must be done with 100 reps. The last three exercises, you can bump down to 50, okay? If it's taking too long. Because honestly, when I was doing body weight exercise for eight months, I, okay, I don't know if you guys know this, but I did body weight exercise for eight months straight, four months off season, four months diet. I didn't touch weights for eight months. I went into the Southern States, novice, I beat seven guys, okay? Yes, I did body weight legs, I did not touch a weight, just only body weight squats. And how did I do it was I did a lot of high volume training. Man, it was tedious sometimes, it was monotonous, but it worked, okay? So the next thing and the last thing we're gonna do is a little unorthodox, but once you guys try, you're gonna like it. Um, basically, it is a deadlift with no weight. Now, you guys are saying, how do I build muscle on a deadlift with no weight? Well, if you need some weight, pick up your ego, okay? That's how we're gonna do it, guys. So you're just gonna come down, slightly bent knees, so it's a straight leg deadlift, and you're only gonna come up a little bit, right? Tap up, tap up, tap up. 100 reps, I think you guys can do that in one set. So, should be a little bit different than some of the other trainers' workouts. Um, you know, in this time, we are very limited and it's a tough time for a lot of people. I know how to exercise at home. I have access to a gym, but a lot of people, they go nuts if they don't work out. And it seems a little trivial in comparison to all the deaths and things like that. It's like, oh, too bad, you can't work out. But what, it's all part of the process, right? We need people in a good headspace to stay positive, stay strong as a community and grow. Not just our muscles, our minds, 
our lives, our world. All right. Thanks for watching. In honor of the last American hero, to whom speed means freedom of the